Good morning. Today, I want to talk to you about something that almost all of us have either gone through or will go through, and that's depression. And that we can have hope even in the midst of our darkest hours. Just listen to the cries we find in the Bible. Like a deer drinking from a stream, I reach out to you, my God. My soul thirsts for the living God. When can I go to meet with him? Instead of food, I have only tears day and night, as my enemies laugh at me and say, where is your God? Yes, the writer of this psalm, he understood depression. He knew exactly what it meant to reach out to God, but feel as though it's impossible to make a connection. That's exactly how the devil wants us to feel, disconnected from the Father. But you and I, we are encouraged to have faith in Jesus and remember that he's always with us, regardless of our feelings and even if we have a sense of hopelessness. It says in verse 8, By day the Lord shows his faithful love, and at night I have a song for him, a prayer for the God of my life. Yeah, isn't that nice? Yes, God is always watching over you with his faithful love. He loves you more than anything. He loves you more than himself, and it breaks his heart. Anytime you're depressed, hurting, or feeling hopeless. But believe me when I say that even in the midst of the worst, most persistent clinical depression, there is hope in Jesus. He has the power to save you, and though you may not feel it right now, I encourage you to have faith in his ability to heal your broken heart. The writer concludes with this. Why am I so sad? Why am I so upset? I tell myself, wait for God's help. You will again be able to praise him, your God, the one who will save you. Yes, friends, God can save you. So please wait for his help. Ask him for even more faith so you can hold on to his promises and wait for the day that you're able to praise him again. Let's pray together. Uh, Heavenly Father, we praise and thank you for this day. Father, I just want to lift up to you all the people out there who are struggling. God, especially we lift up to you those people who struggle with persistent clinical depression. God, we pray for healing for these people. And Jesus, we just pray that you would help us to remember that there is always hope in you, even in our darkest hours. God, increase our faith, increase our trust in you. We praise you and pray for these things in Jesus' name. Amen. All right. Happy Sabbath. Have a wonderful day.